In this video, we're giving you 20 free Lightflare presets that you can use in any of your videos. The link is ready for download in the description, so let's take a look at how they work. The Lightflares will download as a zip file to your computer. Extract that folder, and inside you'll find a single hit film project file, 20 composite shots, and the same number of preview images. To make things easier to see, right-click and group by type. If you'd like to look at all the flares inside HitFilm, you can open up the Radiance3.0.hfp file. There's a composite shot called Display which shows them all. To use these flares in your projects, you'll need to import the .hfc file. Come over to the Media panel and select Import Composite Shot. Navigate to the Radiance folder and select the file for the flare you want. It'll import as its own composite. Copy or cut both the plane and the point, and paste it into your main composite. The plane is set to screen by default, but you can change it to add to make it even brighter. To move the flare around, use the point. The flare looks good when it's on black, but it may appear washed out when you put it over footage. Because of this, on most of the flares I've added a curves effect at the end to boost the contrast. Just checkmark it to turn it on. Some of the flares use features which are not available in the base free version of Express, but are available inside add-on packs. You can either purchase the pack to get the effect that the flare uses, or remove the effect from the plane layer. A lot of the flares use the gleam effect. There is a way to do a similar effect in Express. Duplicate the plane layer with the flares, and add the zoom blur effect. Under the zoom blur center control, set use layer to the same point that the flare uses to move around. Increase the strength to 100. For a more intense effect, duplicate the zoom blur several times. To learn how to build your own light flares, check out this tutorial. Let me know if you have any questions, and I'll see you all in the next video.